What's up guys, the Bobcat here and welcome back to Dark Souls 3. Last time, we had fun times uh, dealing with certain enemies. In fact, why are we dead? Because I don't remember what happened last time. Oh, why are we not embered? Hmm. Well, I'm not sure what happened last time, but regardless. And I'm not sure what we're going to do this time. Oh yeah, I remember now, we were dealing with... Uh, what's his face? Uh, Sorig. But anyway, we're going to take a quick trip back to Phalanx Shrine because apparently there's a bunch of stuff we can buy now from uh, from the Maiden. Oh, not the Maiden, the, uh, yeah, the Handmaiden, I suppose she is. The old lady in the corner here. Also, there's some other stuff we can do as well involving the other NPC. Oh, how? Uh, purchase items. I think apparently she sells armor now. Oh yeah, we can buy the Elite Knight stuff, and we can buy the Black Iron stuff. Awesome. In fact, I'll probably buy that stuff. It's a bit expensive, I won't lie, but we have 78,000, so... Can I buy... When can we unlock this? Or when did we unlock this? Huh. You know, let's buy the Black Iron stuff, because I'm a big fan of that armor set. Um, you know, I'm also tempted to get the Abyss Watcher stuff. Why not? Leveling up's good and all, but... I mean, fashion souls, come on. Although I did want to save some souls. <laughs> oh well. Ashen one from now then, let's go and speak to the NPC over here, because we have her quest line to do. And her quest line, is he still there? Oh, he is, it's a miracle. Do we have any uh, things to give him? Now we've got the Pyramid Domes. But down here, if we buy all the good miracles off her, so none of the uh, evil miracles. So we can buy Hero Replenishment, Caressing, Caressing Tears, and Homeward, and we don't buy Deep Protection on Gnaw, then we should be okay. Let's try this. I'm pretty sure we can buy that one, because it's not a, a dark miracle. And we've only given it one term anyway, so... Yeah, I'll buy these four. You know, in my home I will though, but if I... Oh, terribly sorry. Have a pleasant chat, I pray. Now, I think we have to get some more stuff off her yet, but... That will start her quest line. Now, there's a few different ways that I can go, actually, that quest line, from what I've read. And, uh, do keep this in mind that it has been a few days since I last checked that. So, now we've got the ring finger up there. Can I have a chat with him? I think we're part of that covenant now, although I haven't equipped the uh, sigil. Let's see what he says. Now invade and if you grow, come on, give you. <laughs> okay. Do you have anything new from you? Aha, so. Anything interesting? Yeah. The old King's Great Hammer. Got a bunch of uh, interesting spells. Hmm. Other than that, though, nothing which really interests me. The Pontiff weapons do interest me a little bit, but not enough to bother with them as it is. So, where are we going to go? I am unsure. Also, we can do a bit of fashion souls now. Because we have a bunch of different equipment. Hmm. Not bad. Where's the other stuff? Under Legion? Hmm. The gauntlets are an issue. <laughs> I do like that Pontiff Knight stuff, actually. I like the, uh, the sleek silver look. Maybe we should farm some more of that stuff up, see if I can get the rest of it. And we've got black iron. Oh, chunky black iron. Although it just put us way over in terms of weight. Hmm. Do equip that, and then maybe some of the gauntlets. Now, where are the Abyss Watchers stuff? Nameless. I've probably gone past it. 
Where is it? Nameless, Knights, Herald, Undead, Undead Legion. Hmm. You know, that one's too bad. The helmet's a bit diff, but... Hmm. It's not too bad. Hmm. Let's go with that, I think, for now. How much does our wear? It's at 65. Maybe we can equip a ring. In fact, why are we missing a ring? Hmm. Ring of favor and protection. Very tempting. Uh, I think covetous. Because I do like my covetous. So. Let's take a trip to where? Go back to the pontiff and keep going through on Alondo. I am. I'm very tempted to go down, honestly. So I think I want to head to the distant manor. And explore this place a little bit. I do want to keep. Uh, I want to at least kill some bosses. Now, what was that one boss that was mentioned in the very beginning? It was like the sludge boss or something in the bottom of the Cathedral of the Deep. I'm sure it was mentioned. I don't remember by who, but someone mentioned it. Uh, we'll probably need to torch this up, I think. There we go. It'd be nice to see where we're going after all. So, I don't know what's down here, nor do I know what implications this has on the storylines of certain characters. So, yeah. How dark is it? No, it's not that dark. We can leave the torch off. Guessing they're leading us to an ambush. Oh yeah, they are. No. Hmm. Really, really wouldn't mind getting some more of their stuff. What we have at the moment isn't uh, their stuff, it belongs to the, the fire ones. The, well, the fire witches or whatever they were called. Well, right there for instance. This one. Speaking of this one. Ah, missed. Oh god. Yeah, you spam that attack. Oh well, that could have killed us then. Not taking any chances, just that swinging. I wonder the covetous gold is. I have no idea where that ring is. At all. Which is a shame, really, because I'd like to know. It's only help with getting some of these item drops. Huh. What is down here, I wonder? Uh oh. NPC invader, I think. Judging by the fact that the fog gate just popped up. Yep. Alva, seeker of the spurned. Yeah, hey, it's him. I heard about one. This, because I saw his armor actually, in when I was looking at some armor sets. And he's also using a Murakumo, and that hurt a lot. Drink twice. I said twice. Also, I'm guessing we're not going to try and uh, block his attacks because they seem to break our guard incredibly easily. How has his weapon got a longer range than ours? That is an ultra great sword. That's a Murakumo. I think it's called a Murakumo. That is fun. Two swings. Yeah, wow, that thing's got a monstrous range on it. Nasty. Ugh. I don't want to knock him off the cliff in case he actually drops stuff. That's why I'm being a bit cautious. You reload that drop there. Hmm. Maybe we're taking more damage because we changed out our armor and it's not as heavy as it once was. That could uh, be it. He's going to roll off the cliff at this rate and I don't want him to. You try that. There we go. Hey, we've got a Murakumo. Awesome. Wasted a bunch of Vestas. Oh, we got a bunch back though, so... We broke even. Now what's down here? Because I know there are two NPCs down here. I don't know... Well, I do know who they are. It's uh, Sigward and... Uh, what's the face? Uh, someone else we haven't met yet. Now what armor was I wearing? Was it this? Was it the Fallen Knight? 
I think it was, wasn't it? Yeah, it was Vaughn Knight. How much weaker is that compared to this one? Not much. I mean, it's only like a couple points. Yeah, poise is an issue, certainly, but... Good resistances on it. Oh, there's a bonfire. I'll take that. Right, the Irithyll Dungeon. That way it looks like it's important. Rest, refill. What's this way? Obviously it doesn't open. I need to find a key. Anything in here? Well, there's something over there. What do you think's a trap? Whoa, Jesus. Wow, that scared me. And what's funny is I knew this one was alive because when I ran over it, I noticed that we didn't actually, like, kick the body or we were, like, caught on it for a second. I don't know if anyone else noticed that. Now, what the hell's Rod? More to the point, where did it go? Just a corpse. Must have been in the next one along. Oh. Hello. I feel like there's something like just waiting. And I don't like it. It's freaking me out. What's this? Large Titanite. Well, I'll take Large Titanite. Would prefer chunks, but. You know, we'll make sure we get chunks. Nothing in here. I'm really worried there's like an invisible enemy on the roof. That's what I keep thinking. That is locked. Any secret door, maybe? Nope. Well, if it said locked, I wouldn't be surprised if there was actually a key for it and it wasn't just a, you know. Here's a thing you think you can get through. Apparently these things cast paralysis. So, take no prisoners. Couple of those cages down there. Hmm. Oh, I knew that was a trap. I knew it the second I saw it, but I went with it anyway. Ah, oh. I boo myself for falling for such an obvious ploy. Of course, it would be a spinning soul. Ah, oh. how dumb of me! Like seriously, how is that not a trap? Whoa! Okay, it's one of you. The uh, horse bill. Pyromancy. It's good for dealing with slug, well, slug leech monsters, I don't know what you call them. Some sort of horrific monstrosity. Oh, old sorcerer stuff. Well, I'm okay with getting more sets of equipment. Maybe this trip will be worth it after all. There's a giant slug monster in there. Come on out. No sense in letting you wallow in your misery. Ouch. A, a torch. Pyromancy. That one a bit tougher than the others. Oh, a great magic shield. Well, sorcery her. Huh? Wow, there's a... Uh, dogs look a bit shriveled up. Well, I expected some of these cages to attack us, but they haven't done. So... I suppose that's a positive. What's down here? I see a lantern. I hear something. I am horribly paranoid right now. That looks like a trap around that corner. This looks like a trap as well. Large shell of a nameless soldier. I get the thing there's invisible walls around here. Well, hidden walls, I should say, not invisible walls. Two completely different things. Ah, still got us. Ah! Of course that one was one as well. Oh well, that thing's just throwing dung pies. Yeah, you have to be a bit more careful around these. These ones are a bit more dangerous, I feel. Oh, what the hell? Oh, what? Oh, it's you. I see. 
That thing's like a cursed thing. Now it's gone blue again. Uh, similar to Bloodborne, if you remember the um, Winter Lanterns, I think they were. That thing looks to be sort of an equivalent with its uh, sort of thing where it goes red. Let me sit down. I'll take Dung Pie to the face, I don't care. Ah! Just get brutalised in the middle of these two things. That's not what I wanted, but it accomplished the same goal. I was really hoping for a two-handed one. I thought I'd go fly. Oh well. Yeah, that's horrible. That is truly evil. Still can't get in any of these rooms though. Gotta find that cell key. Hopefully we can find it without much trouble. But uh can't be skeptical about that. Since you don't seem to actually attack. Although I'm pretty sure they do. It's just we're just mm, beating them into the floor. Or they have no poise or sometimes they hey look there's one. Excuse me, that's rude, you also took away my max health. We'll get it back. It'll grow back. No need to worry. Secret maybe? No look. Yeah, bang your head against that wall. Excuse me. Any point to coming in here? Uh, I can't but feel like some of these walls they just look like they can be moved. Hmm. Maybe not. Well, back we go. Jangle the chains. Oh, is that is that an item? It is. Huh. Completely missed that. Good thing we took a step back. Oh! Jesus, what the hell? Where? The hell was that? Oh, that's actual gate. Wow, I thought it was just a window. God. This place is horrific. I'm getting very, um... Tower of Latria vibes from this place at the moment. Which I suppose is a good thing, I mean, most people probably like that, but just the random screening when you pick up items, not pleasant. It's not eerie, just more. <gasps> also, there's a head on that chair. Hmm. Well, let's keep on moving. I'm not sure what else there is ahead of us. I hear something. It's crawling on four legs. It's also one of those things at the back over there. Do you think it stays down here? Maybe not. Okie dokie, well that limits where we can go. So basically we have to make the choice of do we go hurling, hurtling down this corridor? My answer is yes. Let's do something dumb. Sometimes, it's got to be done. That thing didn't even come out. Go. I actually jumped then, again, for no reason. What the hell is with all this, like, shrieking? Oh, there's a hole in that wall. Well, that tells us where to go, at least. Yoink. Nice tight night, very nice. Not a chunk, but you know, small steps. Pale pine resin. Why is this last one? Is he like below us? Is he just freaking out down there? He must be. Oh, hello. I apologize for not noticing you sooner. Guessing you can't get out of that one. The hell is that? I don't know if that's supposed to be a camouflage enemy or not. Well, it didn't really respond to being set on fire. You know what? Take no prisoners. Don't know what it was, but I didn't trust it. 
at all. Who knows, it may have been really important. Now it's dead. I get the feeling it probably would have just attacked us from behind though. That's what all enemies do in Dark Souls. They look passive, and you walk past them and then stab in the back with a knife. A rusty one at that. Shriek. Jailbreaker's key. Hmm. Can we use that? Is that what we need? Bottomless black pit above. Huh. Please be a cruel jerk. Let me guess where that key goes. Just head back. Remember that window we came across? I'm thinking there. Is there anything down there? There is. There's a few of them, in fact. Well, something dumb. Oh, spitting petrification mist. I'll have none of that, thank you very much. Oh, the hell? Put a brand on us. What are they following? That's unusual. Ow. I don't know if they've got some sort of like special thing. A smouldering iron. What is the smouldering iron? Bar the obvious. Where is it? There it is. Branding iron used by the jailers prowling it through dungeon. Press its searing tip against the foot to inflict fire damage, temporarily blocking Esther's healing. Ah, okay. I could see fun times with that in PvP. Just stab. Can't heal. Stab. Can't heal. I wonder if those things are what's causing the horrible shrieking noises. Oh, Jesus! Oh, that scared me. Yeah, you want to try that again? <laughs> Wielding some sort of magical blade. Through the wall. That didn't work. Slightly out of range. One hit. Yep, good. Now what is in here? What are you holding? A simple gem. Huh. I think that's... I have no idea actually what that's for. I would say it would be for... Uh, maybe magic. Oops, didn't mean to do that, but... Oh well, in fact we can check, can't we? If we go to here, simple... Inflict magic damage. Huh, yeah, it restores your... Um, uh, what do you call it? Your magic. Or FP as it's called. Fatigue points, why not? So this looks promising. Obviously. Why am I not surprised? Secret wall. No luck. Oh, that thing flying across the floor freaked me out then. Okay, we've got a crystal lizard. It's clearly a trap. Charge! Nice try. Where are you going? Going nowhere, Crystal Lizard. Can we backstab you? May not be necessary. Also, we're having some frame drops, which are always nice. Anything in here? God, shut up! Look, I'll open the gate, just be quiet. Wow. Come here. Put you out your misery and be quiet. Got an Estus shard. Well, Estus flask for that. That's nice. It's gonna help out. I'm guessing this is one of like where the jailer's key goes. I'll tell you what, we'll grab this item. Probably a trap again. Oh, hello. This place looks almost familiar. I'd say it looks a, a lot like um, uh, what's it called? Oh, can't have forgotten the name of it now. What's it called? Come on, where the dark rates are. New Londo. I say it looks like the New Londo ruins. Look, that central spiral looks like where um, the Four Kings were. Well, before we get down there, let's head back along. I'm trying to open up some of these gates we couldn't open earlier. Is this one we couldn't open? Nope, oh, that's open. I don't think there were any down here we couldn't open, but better check. Just in case. 
You know what? I never set my timer going. I just realised. Well, that sucks. This part might be a bit longer than uh, usual. I've got like 15 minutes on my time because I don't know how long I've been going. In fact, I've been going about 20 minutes if my clock is correct. So, I'll go to, what, 13? 12? 13? Something like that. Hopefully that'll give us a roughly 30 minutes. Can the jealous keep using any of these? No. In that case, I'm not going to try the rest, because I'm pretty sure I know where this key goes. Pretty sure it goes in that door over there. After all, I did say the jailers used it as a cruel joke. Because people who get the key will be like, Yeah, let's get out. Sheer drop. Or oh, more or less a sheer drop, at least. What do you have, though? Oh, the bellowing dragon crush ring. That could be useful. Not for me. You crossbow dude over there. It's always fun. Hmm. I think we uh, do the usual. But thankfully, he was very squishy. And backstabbed. They're not as scary as they look, but then again, I'd rather not tempt fate. I jinx myself, so. Oh, got a mimic. Hello. Do we need Lloyd's talismans on us? Should have some, shouldn't we? Lloyd's? There we go. Oh, a hunter's undead charm. wonder if we can get the symbol of avarice. That noise. Just, uh, excuse me? Hey, we got one. And got an Estus Shard. Cool, got the symbol of Avarice. So, let's do something really dumb now. Oh, I think we've got a ton of health. Also, notice we didn't wake it up. Go, Lloyd's Talisman. It's weird. As that thing was sleeping, it almost sounded female. that. That looks like a giant. Oh, hello. You know, I'm very tempted to throw myself down that pit. Just because we can. Oh, you're not dead. Wow. A bit stronger than the other one. Okay. A few of them are starting to turn up now. These look familiar. At least the hammer ones do. Do a strong attack. Oh, go flying. Looks like the ones from the uh, evang evangelists, or whatever they were called. Still can't say that properly. Probably saying it horribly wrong. One down. Two down. Loot the corpses. Arch Titanite, I'll take that. Uh, you, probably a trap, probably a trap, probably a trap. I expected a fish to break through the wall, I'll be honest. Son of a weary warrior. Nothing down there. Okie dokie. Well, let's take the ladder then. I mean, what could possibly go wrong? The ladder is just like two, two bars down. It's just a straight drop. Should have jumped. Hey. It's a sleeping giant. I think he'll get angry if we go and nudge him a bit. He's a big fella as well. Excuse me. Oh, there's a crystal lizard there. Well, it's gone now. Um, time for something really dumb. Get up. Excuse me. Oh, come on. Don't let it get away. We're so close to it. Drink a minute. It's still running, so I'll take that. Hey, <laughs> thank you. Thank you for the Titanite chunk as well. Have a drink. 
You know, there's probably some stuff you just shouldn't do in the front of a massive giant. And that's try and, like, muck around with it. Up, two, three, four, up, two, three, four, up, two, three, four. Take the pickaxe. Oh, rats. And we're safe. I have expected that bridge to crumble, honestly. Oh, hang on. Sorry about that. Now, I'm not sure how much time we have left, as I said previously. So, we're getting close to where I'm going to call it an end. Ah, ah! Lack of poise, it burns. It feels like rat bites. In fact, I'm very tempted to swap out of this, because the lack of poise just burns so much. Like, black iron. Yeah. But it's so heavy. 16 units. Hmm. Let's talk back to this for a bit. A bit more durable. And we get 15 poise. Although, I don't know, do I want to... You know, I'm just going to stick with it. Stick it out. I like the, uh, the cape it's got going for it. Just love a wary warrior. I hear lizards. What would be down this passageway where the rats came from? I'm seeing items. I'm not seeing giant horrific monsters. Never mind. No. Called it too soon. Do we have a Chloranthi ring? We don't have the Chloranthi on anymore. Well, that makes sense. Let's do a quick ring swap. I thought our endurance was going a bit slower than usual. Take that. And some dung pie, because we're in a sewer. Why wouldn't there be dung pies? Open this. And this doesn't feel safe. It's not, in the slightest. Excuse me, that's rude of you. Oh, we missed one. Hang on. Yeah. That's the danger taken care of for now. I think there's a crystal lizard in there. Or something along those lines. There was one over there as well. Large Titanite. Well, interesting place so far. Oh, wow, there's a bunch of them over there. Jeez. I don't know how I feel about using my last Estus. Oh, there he is. We got that because we killed him earlier. Because why isn't that stuff petrifying us? In fact, I'm glad it didn't, to be honest. But you know what? Never mind. Also, I didn't know if we could hit those guys all on the floor. Well, now let's take a breather. Just uh, have a sandwich. Heal up a bit. <clears throat> I wonder if those things can actually just straight up kill you by burning off all your health. Oh, hello. Looks like there's still a few left. Yeah, that's right. Sit down. Stay down. Well, good thing that one wasn't up here, otherwise that could have got very messy. Oh, there she is. It's, um, I forget her name, but there's the NPC I want to rescue. Didn't even realise she was down here. Well, let's have a drink, I suppose. So noisy. The time. Finally, I'll open the gate. Should be noisy. It's one. Oh, I'm seeing another one. Slow them out. My well, one is shrieking. No reason to put ourselves at unnecessary risk. Oh, they vomit stuff at you. Do you think I thought these things couldn't get any more disgusting? Well, I'm guessing there's probably a bit one more in here. No, there's two. This feels like a trap. If I go over there, it feels like that one's just gonna... Like, freak out and charge me. So let's deal with these ones first. That one was about to do something, so... That dealt with. 
Die hat den. Hm. Warum war hier wieder ein frisches Kind? Profane Coal. Hm. Cool. Trample, that's some use. Oh, didn't even notice this here. It's another mimic, by the way, in case. Couldn't tell. Should I take what's in there? Is it a key? Please be a key. Ah, tiny scale. Shame. It's good, but not what I was hoping for. And now we finish it off. Oh, it's not dead. There we go. Good. Can we open this? We can. Is there anything in here? There is not. Oh, it's Anthus Ashes. And... Son of a bitch. So that's what was making the screeching noises. Well, we've hit 11 minutes on my timer. I think we've been going for 20 already, so... I'm going to call it a part here, I think. Hope you all have enjoyed. Oh, maybe we'll go a bit longer. Come on. Come on, fella. Let's uh, help you out. Still looking for that key, by the way. No idea where it is. Is this all in this room like nothing? Don't feel right. Anyway, we've got it back here. And I'm going to look at where you found that key. So I hope you all have enjoyed. If you have, leave a like. Subscribe to all for a little comment as well. And don't forget to share the video around and tell the people about the channel. We're growing very slowly now, which is quite nice, actually. Good to see new people joining. And I will see you all next time.